and welcome to Tea Time with Bethel and Ethel. Today we're talking about broken hearts. I'm sure one of you has had one or caused one one time in your life. Or oh, in my sister's case, I always had a broken heart like a hundred thousand. No, oh, cry me a bloody river. She did cry me a bloody river last night. Well, I hope she drowned in it. Oh, I did it drown trying to swim my way to bed. Oh, jeez. Well, how do you all live then? <laughs> no, I mean, I hate you. I love you too, sister. Mm -hmm. Anyways, we ended it with her last night. Over some Again. ridiculousness. Well, you know what? You can't have your earrings hot pink and your high heels yellow. You have to match your stuff. Listen, it wasn't because of what she was wearing. It was because she ordered the prime rib. Well, she should not eat red meat then. I told her to stay away from the butter, the bread, the prime rib. The well, is she supposed to live her life without any joy? Absolutely. If she's a spinster, that's exactly what her life is about. Well, I don't think so. Well, listen, I told her to stay away from the butter or to the vegetables. I told her, if you're the one picking up the tab, and are they both. supposed to be steamed vegetables as well? No salt. Absolutely. Oh, my. Here's the thing. Here's my advice that I gave her. Mind you, I've never been married and never had a boyfriend, so I have no recollection on, on, on anything. I have absolutely no knowledge on this, but I did tell her this. If you're going to pay for your dates, you might as well spit the meal, eat as much little as you can, because you're a chunker, and a chunker? You don't call her a chunker. You can see that she's very happy. Listen, he broke up with her last time because her arms moved when she walked. I don't think that's correct. It is correct. He saw, when she sat down, her pants were a little too tight. Well, I like tight pants. Well, you're a tight pants are very sexy. Well, you're a knickknack. Anyway, that's quite all here's right. my thing. If she's going to get her up broken, it might as well be from a celebrity. A celebrity. Absolutely. What, so that every knickknack is looking at her man every time she walks down Absolutely. the street? Absolutely. I don't think so. If she's going to be crying on a Friday night, a Saturday night, and a Sunday morning without anyone having tea, uh, I think it might as she well be over She needs to be with a regular man. Somebody who doesn't work. A I regular give her all of his attention. What do you want her to date? A postman? Well, maybe so. Somebody who's absolutely cute. not. She needs to go with Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber, if you're available to break some more hearts, give my sister a call. Oh, um, heaven's sakes, Justin Bieber! Can I have a little bit more tea? Of course, darling. Oh, we're out of tea already. Oh dear. Who would have thought? It's only nine a.m. We've gone through four <laughs> bottles of tea. That is the case with us. It's so bloody fun. It's well, here's the thing. And like I said, I have no, 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 no knowledge of this at all. And you don't either, you're spinster. Well, and that's quite all right with me. <laughs> By the way, how was your date last night? Actually, it was amazing, as you can see. I'm glad you took your comfortable shoes to walk. Well, because uh, he I doesn't did. have a car, and you don't have a car, so... I don't need a car if I have a date that has a car. He didn't have a car. Look at your high well, heels. Well, yeah, the bicycle. Your high heels are literally... They, they, they've been dragged through the bloody mud. <laughs> well, that's, that's quite all right. They're still red. Let's get back on the subject. Just My date had a bicycle, and that's all right. Because <laughs> you have a little... What, you, what you call those things, huh? <laughs> Listen, chairs. You drank seven bottles of wine before you went on your date. I and highly I am doubt you had it this morning, and that's all right. Literally not standing, more like well, lighting. Sitting, but that's okay. Your lipstick is still smeared from your makeout session. Well, I still look beautiful. Cheers to that, sister. You absolutely do. Cheerio. Cheerio. Anyways, Justin Bieber, if you're not doing anything for the next week, if I you don't agree just... with Justin Bieber, go on, our sister, because every girl is going to be looking at him when look, he walks down In America, street. in America, Brad Pitt is the number one. Hottest man alive. Brad Pitt is 45 years old. He's got 17 children from That's all right. different kinds of countries. I'm sure if he has the heart to adopt children, he has the heart to break someone else's heart. Well, so it's true. Brad Pitt, if you're not doing anything for the next year, if you Here's like my to... number. 818-644-5215. What kind of bloody wench are you? Well, you... Well, sometimes I have to steal. 
I'm sure your date stole something from you last night. Cheers okay, to that. That's absolutely right. He sure did. And it made me very happy. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyone can drink that. Anyways, we're out of tea, so we're going to have to call it a morning if you, if you catch my drift.